Hi, it's Paul from wave5trade.com. Today is Friday the 9th of March and this is my daily video for setting up one of our many stock signals from our membership service on our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. So our members simply get long and short trade ideas from our signals scanner every day on weekly, daily and six minute time frames. We also do a video each day just to show how to set those up. So in the members area, very, very briefly before we go on, uh, we can select long trades and the members simply click on today's and you can see there we've got lots of, you know, every single day so we can go back and back catalogue. So click on to download the spreadsheet and then upload the spreadsheet and then today I've gone for longs uh, on the 60 minute time frame. We've also got daily and weekly and then the shorts as well. So let's have a look at the chart and see which one I've chosen to go through and set up. Okay, so I've chosen EVH on the 60 minute going for a long. But before I do that, I want to go through with the members currently to show them how to set up and isolate the wave count. We've got this very, very broad range bound period. There's no real trend there. If we then zoom in, we can see this breaks out of that range and this is the start of the trend and it's pulled back. So this is where we need to isolate our Elliott wave count right at these lows before we start to break out. So let's zoom in a little bit here. So the 535 oscillators just below pulled below the 90 percent line and that's one of our uh, signals. Uh, that we use for this indicator suite but also with our signals membership it's one of the filters that we have also one of the filters is a stochastics in the oversold zone for this for a long and it's just about to cross over and the wave force pull back into our high probability zones here so let's just zoom in on these probability zones and set up the trade so the wave force pulled back and found support in our green zone. This is an 85% probability. If it finds support here and starts to move away, it's got an 85% probability it's going to go on and make a new wave five high up at $17 in this blue automated target zone in, as part of our Elliott Wave indicator suite. I'm using the Ninja Trader version today, but it's also available for Thinkorswim, TradeStation, and multi-chart trading platforms. So let's go ahead and set this up. So the wave four initially found support. Now it could go a little lower today. So we need to be aware of this. We need to let it find support. But I just thought I'd set this up just in case we uh, we get that move up because we got that nice uh, green doji yesterday rejecting those lows on the last hour of uh, yesterday's session there. So the low here was 1563 so the stop loss is going to be nice and tight at 1562 the entry we've got to be above so i you know even if this moves pretty quickly when in the first hour i don't very much doubt we're going to get into the entry here so in the second hour we are above the 64 moving average high this is the green moving average is part of our indicator suite here part of our entry strategy for longs so we're going to be outside of the 64 moving average high at $16.17. So that's our entry, 16.17. The stock is 15.62, and our target is $17. And as you can see there, we've got a good risk reward of 1 to 1.6. So we're risking 1% between stop loss and entry for a potential reward into our target zone of 1.6%. So really, really simple. Scanners pull out those. Um, signals every single day on the weekly the daily and the 60 minute time frames for both long and short i've chosen a long today on evh on the 60 minute time frame and the la wave indicator suite that we have at wave5trade.com is very very simple we look for those wave four pullbacks we look for it to find support we have the 535 and the stochastic backing us up there we've got our probability pullback zones and then we've got our target zone it cannot be simpler than that and then we just talk about the uh, entry strategy like we did today. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day and a great weekend. And I'll speak to you all tomorrow.